Hello to everyone, it's me Carolina Angulo and today is our third belly dance lesson class. So remember to give me a like and also subscribe and see my other tutorials. Thank you so much and welcome. Big kiss to you. Okay, so let's get ready. Remember to sit comfortable and let's try to relax, okay? So before we start, let's say thanks, thank you. Thank you, dear God, for this new day and the opportunity that you've given us. Thank you for everything. Bless you all. Thank you very much. So let's start. Uh, we're going to inhale and exhale, okay? Let me fix this and inhale. Exhale, try to clear your mind again. Inhale and exhale, leave all your problems behind. Again, inhale and exhale, empty your lungs. Very good. Again, inhale and exhale. Good. Okay, let's start with the neck. One side and the other side. The same thing. Uh, try to relax. Free tense on the muscle of the neck. Okay. Side to side. Very good. Now, front and back. Lift tension front and back continue front and back again front and back very good now let's try to look behind one two three four five six seven and eight now let's do the circle. Starting to the right side, remember, do a big circle. And this is for relax all our neck and our mind. To continue big and slowly. Three. And four. Very good. Complete the circle. And let's go to the other side. And one, relax. Two, leave the tension. Three, and four. There we go. Now let's continue with the shoulders. Okay, let's get ready. Let's relax here. Back. One, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Reverse. Forward, up, and forward. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And up. Back, up, back, two, three, and four. Reverse, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And up, let it go. Up, let it go. Three, four, five, six, seven and eight good so now let's try with the shoulders to put it from like to hit a wall so we kind of start working the shoulder shimmies try to have the correct position and let's start and one and two three four four five six seven and eight and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
and 8. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Continue through 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Very good. If you feel more comfortable this way, do it this way. Okay, remember that is uh, pushing forward. Good. Keep your shoulders down. Try not to tense a lot and try not to move a lot your upper body. Okay, we're trying to start working the shoulder shimmies. Let's continue. One and two. Three, four. Continue faster. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, good. Continue. Try to have the same strength. Uh, if you do one side strong, try the other side to do the same strong, okay? One, two, slower, three, four. If you feel comfortable having your arms different, it's fine. The important thing is doing the movement. Forward, forward. Imagine that you are hitting the wall with the shoulders, okay? Good, let's, let's relax. Very good. So now let's stretch. Inhale, exhale. Feel all that stretch in your back. Again, very slowly we change arm. Inhale and exhale. Very good. Inhale and exhale. Let's do it again. Inhale, exhale. Feel that stretch. And again, inhale, exhale. Very good. So now let's work here, circles inside. Continue, reverse, five, six, seven, eight, good, do this, lift tension, <laughs> so now let's work the chest, okay, like we used before, grab your knees, sit comfortable, and push it all the way up, and down continue up and down remember to push it the more you can and down up and down very good relax your shoulders we are doing this uh movement on the chest helping with our hands and our back okay good again faster Now reverse and uh, put your stomach very, you know, strong. Reverse. Imagine that you're having a ball in the chest. And back, inside. Strong abdominal. Very good. Now let's do side and side. Side and side side trying to get your ribs to the side like if you're doing this okay when you put your arms this way your ribs go to the side so try to do this but with your arms down okay this is the movement one two continue one two one two one two now back and one two one two this is more hard but it's the same thing that like you're doing this movement one two one two one two one two good very good okay now let's do it the diamond okay <sighs> so let's rest here <laughs> Sometimes I get my, you know, my foot legs tense. Okay. Let me fix here and get ready again to do the diamond. And remember, how is the diamond? Good. 
is forward and forward to the left inside and to the other side continue and one two three four a circle big circle okay we are working our upper body trying to uh, make more range of movement okay do that circle the biggest you can and try to relax your shoulders let's go to the other side and one two three and four continue very strong there is a side that is more comfortable than the other one is normal okay now big circle a big circle try to keep your shoulders down try not to move down a lot and the circle very big good very good okay so now let's uh, stretch a little bit get more comfortable and let's go to the side okay let's stretch our back push here and try to look back so you can stretch your spinal back <laughs> good let's go to the other side now push here and try to look back with your uh, upper body you know in a good position good so let's do butterfly one two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight let's go forward remember to reach where you can if you cannot it's okay i i can touch almost the floor <laughs> good go back slowly and butterfly again three four five six seven eight good now let's go to the side and practice the knee movement of the egyptian chimney okay but first let's do this flex and point okay good now one knee and the other one two one two this we do it on the floor quickly quickly so we can uh warm up and also uh, work the sh the chimis okay the jishin chimis how is the movement remember it's one knee and the other one one two one two let's go again slowly pushing the floor remember not to push so you know so strong that you can hurt and continue the most faster that you can try to have your feet relax very good continue good 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 faster faster and one two one two again one two and faster Try not to think a lot of this, this step. It's like if you think it so much, you're gonna get confused. Very good. So now let's get in the floor, relax, and get comfortable. One leg, stretch the other one. Good. Point it on the, on the roof and do one. Try to put a straight two. Three and four. Good. Down and let's get the other one. Push it to the chest. The most you can. And let's get ready. Straight bend. Straight and bend. Good. Very good. So now let's put our feet this way and enter the pelvis and free the pelvis. Enter, move your back and out. This is just to warm up our pelvis and stick the, the belly inside and outside, okay? Look my curves inside, I crush the floor, outside my natural curves on the floor 
good stretch your legs go to the side and let's get ready for go up yay okay go slowly okay bend the knees correct position and let's get ready let's do the chimney five six seven and one and two and three and four let's work with the music continue continue very good keep it up Faster! Keep it up! 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Let's go with the arms. 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Continue. Inhale. And exhale. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Very good. Get ready. Twist. Keep it with the music. 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Slowly. Slowly, keep it. Try not to move your feet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Very good. Keep it. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Very good. Inhale. Exhale. Okay, again, Egyptian shimmy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Very good. We are ready. Warm up. Let's inhale and exhale. Very good. Again. And let's get ready for do it again, okay? Keep it, it's gonna be the same steps, okay? And one, two, three, and four. It's hot here, okay? Let's take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale again, okay? And remember that when you are doing the chimis, okay? Uh, we are, you know, changing the hands. And, you know, I just changed the hands to do it a little bit different, okay? But it's good, it's good. Okay, so now let's work the chimi in a different way. Here you can check my other tutorials about the chimis uh, variations. 
and other stuff so let's work first with the with our food okay just let's go forward and back that's the only thing we're gonna do right now okay it doesn't matter if it's a life uh, right or left leg okay doesn't matter just keep the movement okay one and two keep it forward one and two 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 very good let's go with the other side and forward and back 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 forward very good so now let me show you something if you take your food very far away you know it's not gonna work it's, it's wrong so you have to keep a distance that if also you put a very short you know your hip is not gonna move you have to keep a distance that you feel like your hip is free to do the shimmy okay like for example here I feel my hips free and also your your feet have to face front you cannot you know and also your knees need to be bent and look in front okay if your foots are not looking in the front and you do this with your body you're gonna do you know it's not gonna be correct doing the, the or moving your upper body see you need to give just like a shoulder looking front okay and also each time that you go for example forward you have to move your hips 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 because you're doing the chimney the only difference is that you're moving your feet forward and back okay but you're doing the chimneys one of the mistakes that uh, most of my students make is that they don't you know they don't do the hip movement they just balance the hips okay they just balance like this you need to really focus on doing the shimmy while you're doing the, the hip, uh, the foot movement, okay? So, also one other mistake is that you just do one side, like only when, or this way, you know, like it's like blah. You need to focus really on the hips going up, okay? Let's do it, see? We're doing it now on the left side. Keep the same rhythm, keep the movement. Very good. I'm doing the exact same force in the right hip and in the left hip. See? I'm not just, you know, doing one hip. Because if I only do one hip, it's like just taking the, the foot forward and back without the hip moving. It's just balancing. Good? Okay, so other mistakes, okay? This, exaggerate the, the you know, the, the feet. Just keep it natural, relax, okay? Not jogging, of course, it's not gonna help. <laughs> and uh, let me see what other, well, let's get ready. Inhale, exhale, okay? inhale exhale now we're gonna do a sequence so we're gonna do eight and we're gonna stand in the front one two right seven and when we get eight here we're gonna stop in the middle we're gonna return the hip we're gonna stand in the middle and gonna work the other side one right two you count forward seven eight and you get return the hip and get in the middle so that is gonna make you not get confused you need to stand in the middle why not right eight seven eight stop one two three four five six seven eight stop in the middle okay that's gonna make you not get confused about changing the hips Okay, now let's get ready. Remember, eight and stop in the middle. Eight one side and eight the other side. Bend the knees. And five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, stop in the middle, the other side, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, stop in the middle, again, one, keep it up, two, three, bend the knees, four, Five, keep your smile, six, seven, and eight, stop in the middle, and one, continue, keep the smile, three, four, five, keep it, six, seven, eight, stop in the middle again, woo, and two, Four, bend the knees. Five, six, keep it up. Seven, and eight, stop in the middle. Good, very good. Are you sweating? Inhale, and exhale. Very good, again, inhale, exhale. Did you understand? I hope you did. If you not, please type in the questions. Uh, other mistake is that you have your food that way. Remember that we're working with our food in the ground, okay? Plain, not that way, that's later, okay? So, plain. Okay, so now. <sighs> Let's work the upper body, good? So, it's very important that when you're working your upper body, you try, right, to move only your upper body and not move your lower body. For us, the Latinas, it's more easy to move our lower body than our upper body. It's usually more difficult, the upper body. So, see, the upper body, you need to be concentrated to do the, the movement. And because if you move up and down, you're going to look like another type of dance, like Samba. Uh, or, you know, it, it doesn't mean that you cannot move both sides, but it's usually... Uh, your isolate, you, should, you need to know how to isolate up and down by yourself. Okay, so what we're gonna do for the beginners is that you're gonna squeeze your butt and not move it. Okay, you're gonna have it very tight and very strong. This will help you not to move your upper body. Okay, so you can do the chest lift. You have to be here very 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 uh squeeze okay this way everything out here needs to be very tense so also you cannot move your shoulders okay or try to move it the less possible so when you have your your butt squeeze you see you can control more your body and your body doesn't move like that way also do not do this to your knees keep your knees bent all the time that we're doing this exercise remember this is for beginners why you get more advanced it's gonna be more and more easy to you to control your upper body okay and to relax your shoulders and not to move so much good shoulders if your shoulders move too much try like to put your hand this way it helps a lot with my students like pushing uh, back and also your neck try not to move your neck okay also try not to do this with the body like your upper body going down forward and back okay let's squeeze Put, push your shoulders down if they move so much or you can have it here in the hips like I have it okay now we're doing the chest lift helping us with the back but see my butt and my lower body is not moving if you feel comfortable with the arms like I have it that way, you can have it down to push your shoulders down or you can have it on the hips if you can control more your shoulders, okay? Keep the movement faster like I'm doing it. See, my shoulders, my uh, upper body is moving, but it's moving with control. That's how I teach the beginners how to control the upper body with the chest, lift, okay? Good. Like usually people move a lot of the shoulders. Let's try to have our arms. Okay, this way. Pushing down. It will help you not to move so much the shoulders like 
with your shoulders very up or you know like cats like that and your shoulders are like up good keep your keep the movement keep your knees bent squeeze your butt keep it very good Very good. Just focus and not to move your lower body. Faster. And one, two, one, two, one, two. Have your arms this way if you're more comfortable. Very good. Let's see it. In the side. You can have your arms this way. See, my lower body is steel, my knees are bent, okay? Very good, it's more easy to move down <laughs> than up. <laughs> very good, very good. Okay, good. If you have any questions, please type it on the comments. So now let's do everything without a raise, okay? And squeeze. Let's start. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep it. Now here. Very good. Again. And keep it. Squeeze. Continue. Very good. Rest. Egyptian Chiri. Very good. Now down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep it. Five, six, seven, eight. Twist. Slowly, keep it. Very good. Now we're gonna do the chimney with the foot forward and back. Let's go. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Stop in the middle. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, stop in the middle. Very good. Now let's do a turn. Just keep the rim it. Stay in the side and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Very good. We just finish. Inhale and exhale. Again, inhale. Excel. Thank you very much for being my third belly dance class. So if you have any questions, remember to type in the comments. We did the chest lift and the variation of the chimney, okay? Uh, so yeah, the variation of the chimney and the chest lift were the two steps included in this lesson. So thank you so much. Give me a like and subscribe. And if you have any comment, please Type it on the comment section or you can write me an email. Big kiss. God bless you. And remember that I have a surgery in my left arm, my left knee. I have a hernia in the cervical. I have a six session and I also have a, a lot of problems in my back. So I can belly dance. Belly dance is for everyone. So this class is for people that is sick like me or has a lot of health problems. Thank you. Ciao, see you later.